guys here I am again this is Shelly from Lisa Ravel stickers and when I say here I am again it's because I am going to be filming another dashboard on the left side of this page just so that I can move in everything that I had uh, written down that um, the projects for our contractor so let me just um, get those those were in the may dashboard in my other daily duo okay <clears throat> so um there are some things that we took care of that i'm not going to be transferring but then there's some new things that have come up and while we won't be able to do them all at once it's nice to have a place where we have all those ideas so that we know what to save up for when we have the money we what we can tackle okay so i'm going to be setting this one up over here <clears throat> just so that I have somewhere um, to look and then I'm going to be closing this and just working with my daily duo close this way so um, well before closing what I actually want to do is lay down um, these stickers and just kind of make sure to um, have a starting point so once I have this one laid down, kind of looking to see that um, it was basically more or less on the same side. <clears throat> so again, I wanna set this one up over here. <clears throat> and then for this one, I might just have one list. And um, I think what I'm gonna be using is I have leftover stickers from when, or I will have leftover stickers from when I used the um, kit lineup. So, okay, but I'll do this when the time comes. Let me just focus on what I'm doing. I should have put this one further down just so that I could put the July up here. But you know what, I'm gonna take it off going to take it off and lay it this way because I just realized that I'm not going to be happy if I don't do it that way and whatever <clears throat> I peel up is fine it's 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 not going to be an issue because it's all going to be covered in washi so I just have to be very careful to try to do the least um, damage possible when I'm doing this <clears throat> and it's going to all be covered by stickers anyway, so it's it's okay. You know, it's still going to work. So do not worry. It's still going to be okay. There you go. You see, much happier with it this way. And now I can set up my top washi over here and it looks super cute. You see, that's what I wanted. So then here on the right side, I'm only gonna set up one of the washi strips. I feel like I don't want to, um, so I wanna kinda make it so that it goes, there we go, this way, perfect. Uh, I think I'm gonna leave this as a big list over here. I don't think I'm gonna add um, two lists, but if I need it, then I have the option to do it. We'll see, I don't know, we'll figure it out. Okay, so over here it's house projects. And again, I wanna find a little cute um, house icon like I did on the other one. So let me find my houses. And these house stickers are so great for this. I, I love it. I love using them for this. And I think the red one is gonna pop. <clears throat> Uh, out super nicely and then um, I can use house projects right oh look at that so cute love it <clears throat> now I'm gonna set up all my little um, individual trackers over here and I want to alternate the colors of it so I'm basically setting up two dashboards. And again, I haven't told you guys, like these stickers are from my shop. This is kit 64, uh, the patriotic birds. <clears throat> and I chose this kit 
for July. Um, I, you know, I'm not necessarily the type of person that's gonna use a July kit for monthly, but these birds and these feathers were like so awesome. Like the moment I saw these, I put them in my cart and I said, you know what? This is going to be a July kit for me. I love the birds so much. I think whoever drew this did such a great job. I don't know if the art artist I purchased from was the one who, uh, who drew all of it, but maybe, not sure. Have to figure that one out. <clears throat> I don't know, you might be hearing some noises outside. I, I'm locked in my studio, but I feel that you can still hear what's going on out there, right? Most likely you can. <laughs> okay, and I did the same thing. I'm not gonna need this one, so let me just put it back. <clears throat> okay, now, um, so he still has to do uh, some things in the mud room. So we need to get him to finish that. And then uh, downstairs bathroom, faucets, etc. But it all has to do with the sink. And then my husband already installed the TB mount, but he needs to um, TV cables. So we have some cables that go directly to the basement. Um, the previous owner of this house had it all set up, but they're old uh, because he did that, I don't know how many years ago. So we wanna update it with newer cables and take out the old ones and um, just update with new ones since we have the pathway for that, right? <clears throat> and we are, Still going to remodel Elisa's bathroom, but one of the biggest items was since we have radiant in that bathroom, like the floor was going to take forever. So we're going to do it without that, and it should be a quicker project, hopefully. Um, I'm not sure if my husband is going to do this little by little or if we're going to hire him to do this. It might not be right away, but at some point he will. So it's painting the closets and uh, all closets. So I'm just not even gonna detail which ones. And um, so my studio closet door looks so strange. Um, that needs some TLC as well. I want him to build shelves for the cutters. Um, because he, he, he's very good at woodworking and we have kitchen molding. What else? Um, so kitchen, there's a cabinet door that he can't fix because it's not real wood. You know, it's those composite but I'm just writing it here. Should we decide to just change them all or paint one day? I don't know, but it's still here. Um, so he did install the blinds. Um, okay, so there's something on the kitchen ceiling. When our contractor, when our um, inspector was, you know, turning on all the water and doing the inspection of the house, it started raining from the kitchen ceiling. And since there's radiant there, you couldn't tell that there was an issue. But once we turned the radiant off, it started bubbling again. <clears throat> so I had seen the bubbling. I had asked them. It was not visible. So then we closed that as an issue, you know. But then once we turned off the radiant, it started happening again. So he needs to fix that. And then we need to keep an eye on the ceiling above. Um my studio door <clears throat> and then um, floodlights
and we have some uh, replace bulbs and we have some paint on floor that needs to be cleaned paint on floor okay there we go <clears throat> so these are all these things but then there are some other things that Juan wants him to do so let me just go ahead and use um some of the dots for this but i i just want to make sure to finish up one of these pages um here so it's kind of like this list continues down here <laughs> because there are other things that we kind of want him to um to do if not right now <clears throat> we want to have it on the radar which is a um It's kind of like a basement counter or something that we want to do on the basement. Not sure if we're going to do it right away. Again, we have a, a fixed amount of money and we need to see what it is that we can do from this. And then um, Garage has um, some holes that I need him to cover. <clears throat> and then um, some mason work and he needs to um he needs to finish something he started with the stucco so i want to just write it here so we don't forget that <clears throat> we have that pending and we do need to buy some things and i kind of want to just um write a little bit of a to-do here so what I'm going to do <clears throat> is I'm going to draw a little bit of a line over here just so that I can separate these two. And then I'm gonna use this for a to-do. <clears throat> and for this side, I'm gonna use the little stars. I do have two left over from here, so let me just go ahead and grab those first. Okay, so there are some things that we need to buy <clears throat> to have for him um, when he comes back. And I think we've completely forgotten that we have to buy these things. Uh, so also let me add a couple of things here. <clears throat> House projects, guys. I have a friend, she said, I have various lists. One is the list for when I have time and the other one is the list for when I have money. <clears throat> and I, I, I agree with that. Okay, so um, change front lock. And um, Okay, so what do we need to buy? We need to buy uh, the front door lock. We need to buy, um, <clears throat> I think my husband already bought the faucets. Um, we need to buy faucets. Uh, we need to buy tiles for Elisa's bathroom. And we need to buy a vanity right um okay so then we have some nice ideas and big projects that we would like to do later on but i'm still going to write them here in the things that we kind of want him to do just so that we have a place for everything and and I know that these are not going to happen anytime soon. We need to save a lot more money for these ideas, but they're all in one place and that makes me happy. So add bath to basement. Um, and then fix basement storage area. 
So let me tell you what happened. I was uh, filming and then I had to stop when I was writing basement floors and the other thing that we needed to do because I mean a timer went off and then I thought I had restarted my video but I did not. So the other thing I wrote in is that there's some moving of the AC that we need to do along with the fixing of the basement. So what I did here was I used these um, strips from my compact vertical because these fit the line pages perfectly and I added it here <clears throat> so that I have a place where I can continue the list because believe me, it's going to continue at some point. <laughs> if I know anything, that's what I know um, that we start a certain way, but then we continue with another. And the other thing that I pointed out was that if you guys hadn't thought about it, when you have a dashboard, you always have a line page to the left. So you can buy two dashboard kits and use them the way I did here. So you see, I used A and B, dashboards A and B, and I made it look super nice and cute. And it's just, I don't know, it's its exciting. I'm so happy about it. I love how this looks. It's all cohesive. <laughs> it's whole house related. On the one side, the cleaning, and on the other side, the projects. And I don't know, I love it. And I hope you guys do too. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care. Have a wonderful rest of your week. Bye, guys.